Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Mr. Zaman and today I'll talk about Eczema treatment cream Roflumilast met primary endpoints. Arcutus Biotherapeutics announces positive phase 3 trial results. Arcutus Biotherapeutics announced that the integument PED pivotal phase 3 trial of Roflumilast cream 0.05% in children aged 2 to 5 years with mild to moderate atopic dermatitis or AD met its primary endpoint and all secondary endpoints. In the study, 25.4% of children using Roflumilast cream 0.05% achieved skin improvement by week 4 compared to 10.7% in the control group. Improvement was noticeable as early as week 1. Roflumilast cream 0.05% is a once daily steroid free topical cream in development that is formulated to deliver drug without disrupting the skin barrier. Integument PED enrolled 652 children aged 2 to 5 with a mean body surface area of 22% overall and a range from 3 to 82%. The data reinforced the well-established efficacy, safety and tolerability profile of Roflumilast cream in atopic dermatitis across the integument program. Aspiring to excel in medical journalism and delve into the intricacies of health and medical reporting? Explore our comprehensive course on medical and health journalism available at the Medical Dialogues Academy. Learn from industry experts who possess in-depth knowledge and experience in this field. For further details, scan the QR code or access the link in the description box below. The interventional trial evaluating Roflumilast cream for the treatment of atopic dermatitis in pediatric patients or integument PED is a phase 3 parallel group double blind vehicle control trial in which Roflumilast cream 0.05% or vehicle was applied once daily for 4 weeks to children aged 2 to 5 years with mild to moderate AD. A total of 652 children were enrolled in the study. Incidence of adverse events during the trial was low, with the most common adverse events in the Roflumilast cream treated arm greater than or equal to 2% being upper respiratory tract infection, pyrexia, diarrhea and vomiting. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.